as the highlights. On his toes, set to get his A less than full house at Olympia Stadium to see Bayern Munich take on Hanover, and Sebastian Deisler in attendance has also been cleared to resume training. We're 10 minutes into the match, and Jose Zé Roberto sends the cross over to Michael Ballack, and he gets just enough to beat Mark Ziegler for the 1 0 lead. Watch again as Ballack is late getting under this ball, but it'll hit the crossbar and go in. A closer look shows that luck more than skill helped Ballack score the game's first goal as it hits the side of his head, but they don't ask how, they ask how many. Hanover responds in the 18th minute as Thomas Bedarek fires a laser. But Ali Khan has a great jump on the ball and extends to make the terrific save to maintain Munich's lead. Skip ahead now to the second half and in the 66th minute, Jose Zé Roberto will burst onto the ball and fires at home to double Munich's lead. Zé Roberto comes out of nowhere and without altering a stride, slips the ball underneath Ziegler's arm. Hanover had played reasonably well to this point, but a missed clearing attempt is instead driven into the lower left corner by Roy Mackay. Ziegler had no chance on this shot, and Hanover were staring an insurmountable three-goal deficit in the face. For Mackay, that was his 12th of the campaign, and of note to our Canadian viewers, Owen Hargraves helped to set up the third tally. But Hanover would not roll over to defeat so easily, and in the 81st minute, Stanko Svitlika deflects the cross past Ali Khan, and it's a little redemption for Hanover's spirited efforts and for Svitlika, that was his first ever Bundesliga goal. And a minute later, Svitlika almost makes a game of it, but Khan is equal to the challenge. And then Khan goes incredible Hulk on Zay Roberto and his defense. Canadian international Julian de Guzman gets his second yellow and subsequent red card for this brutal non-call. But the blankets probably welcome as Snow brought this game to a close. 3-1 for Munich and for Hanover fans who thought they had a chance in this game. Is he champ?